football. Uh, the Ravens have suffered a, a bunch of injuries. Six of their starters uh, have been out for the for the season. Baker Mayfield talked about uh, just what they uh, have seen from the Ravens as far as overcoming uh, those injuries. Yeah, I mean, I, I think if you look back at what their you know potential starting roster and depth chart compared to what it is now, they you know to be. Um, where they're at is, is extremely impressive, you know, to be able to have a lot of guys step up um, and a lot of their games so far this year, they've come from behind. So they're a very resilient team and, that, and that's just how they're led and coached. And um, we know that and we expect that coming into it. I think it's going to be a great atmosphere. You know, obviously anytime it's a primetime game, you know, the crowd's more involved. They have a little bit more time to prepare for it, but um, it's an important game for, for both teams. And we, we both know that. And, and Ashley, we talk about the Browns being beat up. Ravens have been as beat up, uh, just not in – it's been more spread out. I mean, they had their running backs and they kind of recovered. It seems like it goes from, you know, tackles to wide receivers. It, it jumps to position groups, almost like it's joining the team meetings for the Browns. Yeah, I mean, and last week, you know, we see Lamar Jackson not be able to play due to some virus that was not COVID-19 related. Um, and they didn't find that out until late Saturday or early Sunday. They still managed to get a win last week. And, you know, I think guys today, it kept coming up repeatedly. This is part of the culture in Baltimore and what John Harbaugh has been able to build there. Um, and, you know, I think that's the kind of stability that he's ingrained all these guys with. It's talk about the peak of next man up mentality. So um, as Cleveland has had to deal with some of these injuries and it's maybe been a bit more unfortunate and things piling up all at once, I really think Baltimore is maybe the prime example of how that should go for good NFL teams and how you can make up some ground in that regard.